Okay, this is just a quick uh, walkthrough to show you how to set up the uh, uh, motion detector with the uh, Pet Tutor Blue app. Uh, I've got this on Android. If you have an iPhone, there'll be an extra blue button here. Uh, but in either case, you want to hit the uh, Begin Training, and you'll see some devices. Uh, the motion detector will be identified as a smart clicker, so we're going to do that so we can trick the app into doing some kind of neat stuff um, uh, features using the smart clicker. So I'm going to hit the uh, hit the check mark, and uh, we're going to connect it up. So this is motion, and then I can start training. So that's what it looks like. I'm going to hit the gear now. Now this is uh, how you can go about uh, changing the parameters. Uh, you can connect it to your feeder. In this case, it's connected to all feeders. You'll see this P1 and P2, and those are the parameters for the motion detector. P1 is the number of seconds. I've got this set at four seconds between each treat. P2 is set up for the number of dispense cycles to run if there is a motion trigger. So if I just wanted to fire it one time if there's motion, P, I'd set P2 to a 1. If I want it, let's say for instance, to fire three times, I'd set it like that for three. So now it's going to fire the feeder three times with four seconds between each trigger. And I hit that and then go in and start training. And now if I move, it will trigger three times. But I want to show you one more feature, and that is the C. And so with the smart clicker, that's the criteria counter. If you drop it down now, it will count triggers from the motion detector. So it's kind of a neat little add-in feature. So there's the first one. There'll be a four-second delay and another one, and then another four-second delay and the last one. And so that was one single motion trigger, one single motion event uh, told the motion detector to fire the feeder three times. So that's how you can use that. And because I opened the C window, I can count how many triggers there were. So kind of neat. I like the uh, fact we can borrow some of the uh, features from the smart clicker. So that's setting it up. Remember, use the gear. You can change the parameters. Uh, the um, P1 is the number of seconds between treats, and P2 is the, are the number of dispense cycles to run. And that's it.